We're here in Bern for the third UN World Data Forum. And first of all, let me say it's incredibly exciting to have at least quite a lot of this community, if not quite everyone, all back together again. Everyone is spending a large amount of the time just saying how pleased they are to see each other. Thinking back to 2017, to the first UN World Data Forum, one of the things that was agreed there was how important it was to get more resources, more financing into data systems so that they could provide the data that was needed to achieve the SDGs. Here, from the vantage point of 2021, it's quite depressing, actually, to hear in a recent session that 92% of low- and middle-income countries don't have the resources that they need to produce the data required to track COVID, to track the Sustainable Development Goals, and to provide a good guide to policymakers. It's always been quite hard to persuade governments and external funders that data is something they should invest in. Although everyone uses data and understands the importance, it's never been the most exciting of topics. But this year has really illustrated most vividly to everybody the critical importance of data. We've all been poring over the daily numbers of COVID and as climate hits every part of the globe and all countries are confronted with the reality of floods, of wildfires and the devastation to human lives that is caused by climate change, we're all understanding the importance of data to plan for, to predict and to track a path out of these growing health and climate crises. We're also seeing the costs that lack of investment in digital and data technologies can have in the form of cyber attacks and the kinds of threats to national security that certainly focus attention and require big and sustained investments worldwide if we're to combat all the various threats that are arising. What we're seeing here today at the World Data Forum is perhaps the glimmers of hope that data finally is rising to the top of the international agenda. We're pleased to be hearing today about the World Bank's new global data facility, a financing instrument that it's hoped will mobilize new resources to invest in data systems all around the world, but particularly in those low and middle income countries that need it most. And the Clearinghouse, which will provide clarity and transparency on where data is needed and help coordination. This UN World Data Forum is perhaps the moment when we start to see the first steps towards real scaled up and sustained and smart investments in data and the data partnerships that are going to provide us the pathway out of crises and towards realizing the promise of the Sustainable Development Goals. I'd love to hear what you think, so please do get in touch.